Welcome to Upgrade. I'm your host, Frank the Tank, and we're going to bring a new item. It's actually, uh, it's number one sales right now in Amazon. We're going to see why. It's actually, uh, uh, it, this is a water cooling system. It's actually a radiator for your PC. So let's take a look at it and see what you get when you purchase them like this. I'm going to compare it with a different version of it. All right. So the box came really, really covered. Good support on it. So they give you the actual radiator here. Uh, a little thick. I like it. Um, big long radiator and they have different sizes of course so it's a really long radiator I'm gonna take a look at it, it came with really good cover support I like what they did they give you it's not damaged or anything when it was shipped uh, on top of that they give you the actual screws in here and I think they only give you one set oh actually they give you four three sets so let's remove these out of the way and let's talk a little bit more about the radiator now the radiator is it's it's well protected it's a little thicker than other radiators i'm looking at it and right now its thickness is about uh, it's about an inch and 1.4 so it's not that bad it's not it's as huge it's bigger than other ones that are thicker and why and they give you that little clearance here so the screws won't hit the actual radiator part of it uh, this gets damaged very simple uh, it gets bent and stuff like that and um, during, during time if you damage it or anything nothing really happens but um, less airflow and we're gonna bring that up we're gonna bring another one compare it to it so if you're doing your own mods instead of uh, buying one set to go this might be an option for you and you can always replace your older one but you're just gonna have to replace liquid in it so um, it's another option so let's go ahead and put this aside and let's compare it with a, a different version of it and uh, this this one's actually a um, it's a little damaged. It's an older one, and this is an NZ XT version of it. Of course, the holes are a little too thick. These are really thick holes that they have in here um, for this comparison. But if you guys see the difference on the size of it, it's a lot smaller on the the thickness. It's a lot smaller in here. Um, so the clearance. I'm gonna see if I could put a little video on it so you guys can see it. I'm gonna put it from the top how thick it is. Um, this should be in probably in the bottom so you guys can see it better uh it, it's a little smaller and there's a clearance right here if you guys can see it um so on this one particular it, it comes with the same thing it's about the same size but minus the actual pump you're gonna have to buy the pump for this one of course this is for a self modification and like i said the damaging the centers is a little simple they get dink a lot if you guys can see it the colors this uh, i must have damaged it here just scratched it but it's still good it's still valid there's no water leaking or anything like that this is only the top of it um don't recommend you guys damaging like it this is an old one that's why i use it for only reference there's no water on this one it actually dried up after maybe two years on it so it lasts me a while and this is an older version um but i just wanted to show you guys um how the difference between uh, uh your own modifications compared to the actual nzxt version of it um the good thing about this one it comes with this pump already it's all ready to go you just mount into the cpu or G and they even have a gpu mounts and so it's uh, uh this company nzxt makes a lot of modifications they have a lot of threadings for actually the gpus and the cpus amd and intel um really good options that they have but they're very pricey i mean if you're trying to buy something like this it's going to cost you a lot more especially if you're trying to build your own mod it's you're probably better off buying the parts separately but if you want to simplify your life and you want to make it quick i would get this version the ncxt but if you're going to do a modification like to hands-on on everything then this might be an option for you and um, right now it's number one in in amazon um because it's probably the cheapest one i found in amazon and now the prices are going to start picking up because a lot of people are staying home and they're doing modifications and this is one way to start your modification start now um buying slowly your parts and then later buy uh, you'll get the desktop and the motherboard and the cpu and you know hopefully by the time that you completed all your collecting your parts maybe you'll be able to get one of those uh, rtx 380s they're probably not available right now anywhere um and then you can modify that one to actually do the water cooling now this is going to be for just the gpu the cpu right now but i do plan to add the modifications to the gpu as soon as i get a 380 and then they have uh, modifications for 380 mounts because unfortunately not a lot of vendors are coming out with that only a quite a, only a little handful of vendors are coming out to overclock or add water cooling to the gpu so 
that will be down the line. But for now, I'm getting ready to modify uh, a whole a motherboard with the CPU water cooling. But this is a great option. And if you guys have any questions or any comments, let me know. I'm your host, Frank the Tank, and we're out.